What's up everyone? As a request that I'm gonna review a full day of eating by Lean Beef Patty. Good morning. It's another beautiful day in the neighborhood. Today, we are going to be eating and working out. Starting off, this is actually my second cup of coffee, but prepared exactly like the first one. She already had two cups of coffee in the morning, which means that she has no energy whatsoever to start her day or to do anything, which is typical among people who go to the gym. Next on the agenda, after I have been satisfied with my coffee consumption, will be breakfast. Breakfast these days are pretty boring. I always wish I was one of those people that made really aesthetic, attractive meals, but I just simply cannot bring myself to care. So they usually are ugly. And we'll be seeing more of that today. Okay, first meal. What does it matter how your breakfast looks like? That's completely unnatural to even think about it. Day. Oatmeal. This one is protein oatmeal. I usually get regular oatmeal, but uh, this was in the house, so big ups. Oatmeal only has fiber, which is indigestible, sugar, anti-nutrients, and glyphosate. That's it. Um, absolutely horrible. I found whenever I use a microwave, uh, it causes some people distress. If you don't like the microwave, if you're afraid of the waves, cook it on the stove. Protein powder of choice. Today I have Gorilla Mine Cinnamon Churro. Yummy! Bee pollen. I saw a video somewhere talking about all the benefits of bee pollen. I don't remember any of them, but I hope I'm getting them. <laughs> and honey, pro life hack. If you have allergies, invest in some local honey. That should help with your allergies, or so I hear. I don't have allergies. I also don't have local honey. Last thing I've been doing recently, uh, collagen peptides. Makes for a tasty beverage and potential reaping of other benefits. They don't help whatsoever. All that you need to do is eat raw animals, but uh, of course she would never do that. She's too brainwashed and uh, why does she even do that? Did she realize that she looks way too old? She looks 10 years beyond her age. <laughs> I do it for the tasty beverage aspect, though. Stop lying. Oh. My first meal of the day! Oh my god, man, that looks horrible. That doesn't even look like food. Some kind of a blue drink, which would never occur in nature. And then, uh... Seeds? Yeah! Great prison food. In tarnation? Is that? What is that? Oh my god! Oh my god! It looks like a bug leg. I think it might be a bee. See that? Looks like a bee leg. Oh my gosh! Extra protein, extra vitamins. Yeah, that would actually be the healthiest thing that you could eat here. The pollen definitely has a flavor. I don't think it's a good one. Yeah, it's pretty disgusting. I've tried it. She looks so incredibly bad. I really have trouble watching the video because I have to look at her. Don't drink it by itself, though. I tried to do that once and it is so much thicker than I thought it was going to be. We oui bien. Listos. Okay, warm up on the assault treadmill. Spooky! Okay, let's sum it up. In the morning she had two cups of seed soup to pump up her adrenaline like a typical drug addict. Then she had a bowl of sugar, fiber, anti-nutrients and other toxins with a blue drink because she's afraid of aging even more. But uh, you're not gonna be able to stop it because your diet is horrible and you work out you're gonna age incredibly badly. You're gonna look 50 plus years old in the next few years if you don't stop this. And now she's on a treadmill like a hamster. Perfect slave life. Five to 10 minutes, you know the drill. Now for a wee bit of mobility. Ooh, this band is way too tough. Where'd all the other bands go? Oh.
Is this a joke? <laughs> I, I can't tell. Okie dokie, exercise number one for the day, lap pull downs. Wow, she even puts the grasshoppers in the background because it's as if she understands how pointless and meaningless it is. Why do you even do this? Why do you sit at this machine pulling the man-made metal for no reason? What do you achieve by that? Yeah, nothing. Torture. Workout videos are incredibly boring in general, but this one is probably the worst I've ever seen. I will be enjoying two rice cakes because Disgusting. I figured I'd be a little, a little bit in the need of a snack. Here we go. Oh my god, how can you eat? Uh, that is so insanely disgusting. I wouldn't even be able to touch it. And uh, it's full of arsenic, and that's because rice is full of arsenic in general, no matter what kind of rice you get, except if you get insanely organic, mega supernatural rice, which basically doesn't even exist anymore. It's literally just a baked sludge cake full of poison for slaves. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> and dry. Next is probably gonna be lunch. Unless I decide to have another snack somewhere along the way. She's so unbearable to watch. This is one of the worst videos I've ever reviewed. And here we are, home once again, getting ready for one of my favorite little meals. Canned tuna. <laughs> Step one, canned tuna. Canned tuna is freaking full of toxic heavy metals. Jesus Christ, man, I can't anymore. Yeah. Step two, uncan the tuna. Step two should be throw it out of your window. Condiment time. I like mayonnaise, mustard, relish, classic tuna setup. The mayo of today is full of seed oils and the rest also actually. <laughs> this is guaranteed atherosclerosis. A wee touch of garlic salt. Garlic salt is very toxic. Why do you do that? If you would eat the whole thing, you could possibly die from it. Delicious. What better to accompany our delicious tuna meal other than tortilla chips? Why do you have such a huge bag of chips, man? What the hell? Tortilla chips again. Seed oils. She wants to have a heart attack. She wants to have blocked arteries. That's her goal with this diet. And the piece of resistance. A carrot. Muy bien. Every single- No, not muy bien. Why do you lie for the camera? At least she's eating meat. Okay. But in the worst way possible. With the worst condiments. And why the carrot? Just why? Single time I eat tuna, I think about the possibility of mercury poisoning. Not because I eat that much. You shouldn't be worried about the mercury poisoning, man. There's other toxic heavy metals from the can that you should be worried about. What the hell, man? <laughs> tuna, but because when I was in fifth grade, my teacher told us all a story about how she ate tuna every single day for lunch. And then after a while, she got mercury poisoning and thought, she ate canned tuna. She got heavy metal poisoning. It's not the freaking mercury that you should be afraid of. Thought she was dying. <clears throat> I think about that now every time I eat tuna. Just get wild tuna. Eat it raw. Eat tuna sashimi. You will never get any side effects. If you've ever gotten mercury poisoning, please comment below. Tell me about your experience. I know how you could get mercury poisoning, but I'm not allowed to mention it on YouTube as I do not believe I have experienced it myself, but I may have. 
most children on earth are pumped full of mercury through this one specific method. Mmm. Carrot. Okay, so you actually eat a whole carrot for no reason. Why do you do that? Carrots are incredibly hard to digest. They really cause gut problems because of the hard fiber. And they don't have anything. They have very few minerals. No vitamins. Incredibly little vitamin C. She's eating it raw, so she's getting incredibly little vitamin C from it. That's it. Uh, carrot toxin, of course, also. These kind of carrots are the best. Even better than this, the 50-pound bags of carrots you can get from, like, animal feed stores. Best carrots in the world. Oh, my gosh. Something about the dirt on those carrots just makes them taste immaculate. Wow, her videos are incredibly bad and almost depressing. All right, we're back. It's time to make beef. Let's go. Here I have rice from two days ago um, when I ordered Thai food. I'm just going to heat that up, but Pro Hack Ice Cube in there keeps it from getting dry. Microwave. Lovely. Beef. Assorted steamed vegetables. Okay. Lastly, some milk. Okay, she eats overcooked meat, which means that a lot of the protein has been destroyed. Man-made vegetables, which don't exist in nature. The very toxic kind also, and uh, some pasteurized milk. If she would only be eating the meat with a lot of butter and the raw milk instead of pasteurized milk, then this would be an actually decent meal. Even though this is non-fat milk, which is extremely <sniffs> mediocre, every once in a while you just really need a, <sniffs> a glass of milk. This is the way the intersection is, okay. Main street, intersecting street that has a stop sign. The crosswalk situation is kind of sketchy. It's like, is there a crosswalk there? Is there not a crosswalk there? Back to the ice cream. I don't think I'm gonna measure this. I was going to, cause I've been like measuring everything else. But I'm just like not in the measuring mood. You know what I mean? Like I just wanna eat. I just wanna have a tasty little treat. It's not that serious. She was telling some kind of story about cars, but she's so incredibly boring that I couldn't listen to it. Uh, this video is unbearable in general. Serious to me. So I'm just going to enjoy this tasty treat and not really. I think that this um, company actually creates ice cream with proper full fat milk, uh, if I'm not mistaken, which is good. There's worse things than ice cream. At least she's getting maybe some kind of fat soluble vitamins. At last, in this day of eating, um, it's pasteurized. Um, who knows how much there is left? Anyway, um, last thing I would like to say is this was for entertainment purposes only. Please do not try to emulate this exactly it will not work for you and it probably was this actually supposed to be entertaining will not benefit you in any way except for maybe if you like one of the snacks or meal ideas that i had even though in my opinion they weren't all that creative but maybe it's something new to you that you'd like to try that's great that's kind of what i would want other than just for entertainment purposes but i in no way shape or form made this video wanting someone to try to copy exactly what i eat in a day because even i do not eat this way every single day you should be eating what your body requires of you to feel good inside and out oh. um, and with that last part being said thank you for watching please do me a huge favor if you could like this video subscribe to the channel if you are not already and please leave a silly comment below because i always love hearing from you and reading your silly comments she seems like she has a lot of mental issues and i will see you in the next video adios Okay, this video was actually way worse than I imagined. 
It reminded me of that video where the girl was eating pine cones in Siberia. It also had a miserable and sort of depressing uh, tone. And that's because the girl in Siberia was depressed for sure. And uh, she is also... I recently already reviewed a video of hers where she was with that uh, baby pig. Where is the pig actually? She probably already gave up on the pig. Of course, because it's unnatural to take care of a pig. She obviously wants to have children. That's because all women naturally want it. All men also do. That's just what human beings want to do. They want to procreate. When you do bodybuilding and um, you're biochemically more so a man, then it may be different. You may not think about it as much, but it's very clear from that video alone, the last one, that she wants to, of course, have children. That's why she's so miserable and uh, also because of her diet. Um, it's not that terrible, at least she eats meat. It doesn't seem like she eats enough animal fat, which is what she really needs to feel good. And she eats a lot of garbage, a lot of anti-nutrients and artificial toxins were consumed in this day. The tone of somebody's video really displays the way they feel. You can just tell that she has no energy throughout the whole day. That's why she needed to consume two cups of coffee. She's exhausted, depressed, miserable, really unhappy. A really terrible video. It was unbearable to watch. Thanks for watching.